morning, y'all. Well, it's uh, 46 degrees this morning, day after Thanksgiving, Black Friday. And uh, I'm not going to go shopping today. I have to actually work tonight. Asked Joey to come out with me this morning, and he said no, that he uh, has to get acclimated and be on night shift since he's going to be working uh, nights this weekend. We're going to run over to a little bit different area today. Uh, normally we launch here at Port Bay at uh, the end of Port Bay Road. But I'm going to run over to Copeland Retreat Road this morning and uh, try my hand over around Swan Lake. Um, I heard that there's a little bit of redfish and some trout. We'll see what happens this morning. So uh, stay tuned and get ready for the shenanigans. becoming rather annoying. So, didn't have the best of luck so far today. I've been going around, tried out in the middle, tried shallow up against the shores. The only place I saw any action was over there in that cut and there wasn't much going on over there. Water super still, super, st this looks stagnant here. Um, the water was super clear over there at Cove Harbor yesterday, over here, and it just, it's just mucky. So, I'm going to start working my way back to the launch. I'll fish around a little bit here, see if maybe I can't find something running down these uh, shorelines, but not making any big promises or hopes, unfortunately. We'll see. Well guys, I'm kind of drifting this flats over here. Uh, coming back up to the kayak launch, which is right over there. I just had a strike on my popping cork. So, maybe there's a fish or two in here that I can get to take the bite. We'll see. Dang it. There we go. No. Huh. I don't know, guys. Maybe it's... <laughs> Maybe they're super dinkers. There's a lot of activity right over there. There we go. There we go. Finally. He's a little dinky. But we love him anyway because the small ones need to love him too. The small ones need some loving too, guys. I want to rip out his lungs down in there, or his gills rather. It's a fair ways down in there. There we go. I didn't hurt him. He wasn't even bleeding. That's awesome. Well, let's see what's up in here. Saw some wade fish around here this morning. I hit up this spot. Didn't really see much. Tried it a little bit. Oh, I smell this fire this morning. There's a big fire over there towards Bayside. 
don't know if it's controlled burn <clears throat> or an actual grass fire, but there we go. Nope. He hit it. Didn't didn't hold on. Folded it up though. Definitely folded it up. Dang it. There's a little bit better fish there. Fish on. Might be a little bit better fish. Not a lunker. No, still a dink. Still a dink. He didn't come skiing up to the surface, so. I was like, well, maybe it's a possibility of a little bit bigger fish. I was wrong. What's up, y'all? Had a good day on the water. Caught some small trout. Didn't find any big keepers, but that happens. At least I didn't get skunked and not catch anything. Um, tried out a new body of water that I've never tried before. Kind of explored it a little bit. Don't know if uh, it's an area that I'm really going to hit up that many you know, more times, but at least, uh, at least I tried something a little new today. Time will tell with that spot, but we'll see how it works out. I think over time, if I learn the area a little bit better, I'll have more success over there. But still had a good day and kind of sad that Joey couldn't be out there with me today. But that's just one of those things where you got priorities to take care of. My priority was to be out on the water this morning. So like, comment, share, subscribe. Put the little notification up there so you get the little, the little bell. All right. Until next time, keep your lines tight, and it's all about friends and family.